Hi, I'm Robert. Welcome to Manhattan Wood Project. This week's project is my entry for Jason Roush's Wooden Game Challenge. It looks like there's going to be quite a few good entries, so make sure you check out this playlist right here. I made this fancy little Sudoku game that came out a lot better than I could have even hoped for. And my kids have already spent a few hours playing with it, and they love it. This video that I'm making for this is just an overview showing how I made it. You can find more in-depth description by clicking on one of the links in the description below. Oh, and don't forget to watch the video all the way through. I've got a special announcement, and that's all I'm going to say for now. What should I make today? Manhattan Wood Project. That looks great!
on. Hang on. Why I'm gonna put this here is because it can't go here because this and there needs to be an egg in this row. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm putting this in here because four and I'll also put the eight. Because four and eight are the only numbers that are missing in this and box right here. Two. Right here. You guys see why I put that there, right? And um, um can you get the one? It can't go down here. Can you get a one in this row or in this row? Yeah. Anna. I should pay attention. I think you should get a one. Okay. Four. Ta-da! Hang on. I did the four that I led you to do that. Three, four, five, six, seven. Where's the eight? I need an eight. I need an eight. I need an eight. Where? Eight. Five. Two. Well, it can't go here. It goes there. I need a four. I need a four. I need a four. We're done! Okay. Oh. This project was fun, but it took a long time. I designed the board three times. Once for prototyping, just to kind of get an idea of what spacing I liked. I didn't like this. And the uh, two redesigns were to add design elements and kind of tweak things like the depth of the cut. It's the first project I've made that required three bits and six different types of cuts on the CNC. But the time spent on the design and waiting for it to be cut out was well worth it. Now, the number of cuts on the CNC presented a couple of good challenges and allowed me to learn new ways to use it as an extremely useful tool. <laughs> yes, a tool. I call the CNC a tool. It's a tool that when it's properly maintained and used, allows creativity to be expressed in completely new ways. However, I don't want this video to be the battlefield between those who think that CNC isn't woodworking and those who are correct and think that CNC is just another tool that can be used in a large woodworking toolbox. I'll provide that battlefield in a future video, but not this one. As for the other tools, I've never used a syringe to do uh, paint like this before. I've done it for little drops on domino tiles, but never something big and fancy like this. I've only used a card scraper a couple times and never really understood it, never really did well with it, until I watched Matt Cremona's video on sharpening and using uh, card scrapers. It's a great video, you should check out this link right over here, because it helped me immensely. I was able to uh, scrape the paint and the layer of sanding sealer off such that when I went over it with a little bit of finished sanding, I wasn't spreading dried paint all over and into the grain. So this looks beautiful, and I think it's probably because of using the card scraper. The card scraper and the syringe, two great tools I'm looking forward to using on future projects. And now for the part that all three of you have been waiting for, the special announcement. I knew the X-Card would play a big part in this video, and I asked the folks at Inventables if they wanted to give me something to give away. Figured maybe I'd get a hat or a t-shirt or something. Nope. Their CEO, Zach Kaplan, graciously gave me two $50 gift codes to give away to you, my wonderful viewers. You don't even have to own one of their CNCs to enjoy it, because Inventables sells all sorts of stuff. They sell materials, they sell finishes, knives tools. You can go to their site and you can buy veneers and exotic hardwoods like Purple Heart, Marble Wood, and Padok. I think that's how you say this, Padok, Padok, I don't know. But you can buy it there. So to have a chance to win one of those gift cards, you have to make a comment on this video down below talking about a less than normal tool that you use or you're interested in using for a woodworking project. For me, that would be the card scraper and the syringe that I use for the paint. For you, maybe you want to use a large heavy chain to antique your project. Just beat the hell out of it. Or maybe you want to try carving with a chainsaw. Or maybe just try using a circular saw because you've never used one before. Just tell me about a tool that interests you and the project that you want to use it with. And no, your chances do not improve if you say you want to see and see. Doesn't work that way. Sorry. So the giveaway will run for one week and it'll be over on Friday, July 15th, 2016 at 5 p.m. my time, mountain time. 
I'll draw the winners at random from a list and I'll try to contact them by YouTube message, comments, or any other method I can find. If I don't hear back from them by the next Monday, I'll choose someone else. So if you have a vague YouTube name like Billy99 and you aren't Billy99 on Facebook, you may want to make sure you can get messages or notifications on YouTube because I'm going to try my best to get in touch with you, but if you only get on YouTube once every six months, it's not going to work and I'm going to have to move on to somebody else. Full rules are listed in the description down below. If you're interested in details about this project, like the CNC bit size that I used, feeds, speeds, what kind of paint, uh, what kind of finish I used, I put a link to the official Invenables project for the Sudoku board in the description down below also. And you can find it at manhattanwoodproject.com. So please take a little time to watch the other wooden game challenge videos and to visit my website, which is being updated and expanded little by little. Also, please don't forget to share this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and leave a comment below to let me know what you think, and to give you a chance to win a gift card. $50. That's awesome. Thank you very much for watching this video, and I will see you on the next project. Did you like this video? Let me know by sharing it, giving me a thumbs up, subscribing to my channel, and leaving a comment down below. Also, take a few minutes to visit my website, manhattanwoodproject.com, Follow me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. Makes yours look like a drop of water. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs>